Hey y'all, it's June 5th and I'm starting my weight loss journey today. Um, I tried to start uh, January 1st of this year and wasn't successful. But I'm really taking it seriously this time. I'm not going to really do much talking about it. Um, it's all about action, you know. Um, I've been making a lot of excuses. But I did buy a treadmill. Um, my plan is to just, you know, keep it simple. Just keep it simple. You know, 75% of weight loss is just about, you know, eating healthy. I'm trying to do a little bit of inner, inner minute, uh, intermittent fasting. Um, I'm going to make sure that I don't eat past 9 o'clock. I go to bed. See, my sleeping pattern is different from yours. I go to bed around like 3 every night. I'm a night out. So nine o'clock is a good time for me to, uh, you know, eat my last meal. Um, may even eat a little earlier than that. But um, I'm currently two sixty-five, so I'm fat as fuck. Um, but I'm just tired of looking the way that I I do. Um, I'm tired of not being able to wear the nice clothes that I used to wear. I never bought like real expensive clothes. Um, I was never really into like name brand clothing. I just like to, you know, look nice and uh, dress well. And I haven't really been able to do that because you guys know how clothes work. Um, if you're big, um, your shirts are going to be uh, your sleeves are going to be long and with me being a short guy that doesn't work really well for me um and it just i'm, I'm just tired and, and at some point i have to get serious about my weight and my health most importantly i'm just tired of walking around looking like a fat pig with my stomach sticking out it just makes me look much older than what i i am and um you know, I want to. I want. I want to look sexy. You know what I mean. So that's another motivating factor. You know, I want to look in the mirror and, and and like what I see. You know what I mean. Um, I want to be more desirable. You know, I mean that's a part of life. If you want a a man or a woman, you gotta get in shape and stay in shape. You gotta at least be appealing. You know, to uh, expand your options. You know, so those are motivating factors too. But most importantly, it's just about myself. I just want to be healthy it feels good when i eat uh the right foods and when i'm putting a lot of vegetables in my body a lot of green leafy vegetables in my body um i i for me it's it's how i felt physically in london that was a wake-up call i just feel bad when i eat bad you know what i mean like you are what you put in your body and um so what i'm gonna do i'm eliminate red meats i'm gonna be eating like all white meat I don't think they call it white meat, but chicken, turkey, salmon, fish, stuff like that. Um, you know, eliminating fatty foods, carbs, sugar. I eat a lot of sugar or consume a lot of sugar, rather. Um, the sodas are done. No sodas. None but water um, to help detox my system. Um, losing weight isn't really that hard. It's just you just got to eat healthy. <laughs> you know, people make a big science out of it. It's really not that hard. Just eat healthy. Just, you know, eat lean meats um, and lots of, of vegetables, you know, um, and drink water. Drink lots of water. It's good for the skin, good for your overall health, good for detoxing. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, eliminating fried foods, sugar, uh, soda, um, sweets, candy, ice cream, late at night. All that shit is done. I'm done with that. Um, I just have to be, and I, and I know I am, I, the motivating, like, I, I, I'm not, I, I can do it. It's not like a major struggle for me. It's not like I'm one of them people off of 60, 600, uh, uh, pounds, my life, uh, reality show where I just love to eat. I'm just lazy, but I don't like the way I feel anymore. I just feel really, really bad. Like when I eat a cheesesteak, I feel really bad afterwards. And this weight that I'm carrying is is going to cause a lot of health issues in the future you know um it, you know it can being big can kind of damage your, your joints and your, your cartilage you know like 
it's a lot of weight that I'm carrying on, on these feet. You know, that's why I, could, I couldn't walk much in London and why my ankles and Achilles was hurting so damn bad because all this goddamn weight, if I was much lighter and the weight that I should be like one. Oh, by the way, I'm not going to follow the BMI chart. I'm not going to get down to the 120. I'm going to, my ultimate goal is to be somewhere between 160 and 175. And at that point, once I lose this weight, I'll start lifting, lifting weights and building muscle. But I'm 265 right now. I want to get down to 230 by December. And I want to get down to 200 by next year around this time. So next year around this time, I want to be 200 pounds. Um, and then once I get to 200 pounds, I'll focus on, you know, getting into the, the, the 100s, you know. But I got I to gotta get out the, the 200 uh, range and I'm deep in the 200s. So right now I got to set like small goals. Um, think big, but, but you take baby steps. And right now I'm just thinking about 230. Which is still huge for somebody at my height. 230 is huge. And I'm 265. So I just want to get down to 230. <clears throat> if I get down to 230, that's going to really motivate me. And uh, the more weight that I lose, the harder I'm going to go, the more confident I'm going to become. And um, I know I can do this. And I'm just going to start now, man. I'm eating a lot of solids and shit. Um, I haven't even eaten all day because, you know, uh, one thing I'll say, you got to prepare uh you have to do a lot of preparation when trying to eat healthy because you have to prepare your meals because it's not as easy as it is when you're eating unhealthy you can just order from mcdonald's or order you know doordash um you know go go on doordash and and order a pizza or a cheeseburger you know because there's a lot of restaurants that sell unhealthy food there aren't too many of them that sell healthy food you know so um your your options are much smaller when you're trying to eat really healthy. So, yeah, I'm gonna do eating a lot of boneless chicken, uh, salmon, and shit like that. Lots of vegetables, you know. Um, what else do I want to say? Yeah, the breaking point was just the, the going into the stores and not being able to wear the, the clothes I want to wear. Like when I seen that I was a size 42 in pants, I was like, oh hell no. Like, the shit that I wore to Jamaica, I couldn't, that was just September. I can't even fit those t-shirts anymore. Like, I used to wear large t-shirts forever. I can't even wear large. I'm, like, double XL now. You know what I mean? Like, my shorts are, like, 2X and 3X. I'm like, oh, hell no. Look at this. Like, I don't know if I can fit this up. But. Like, it's my stomach. How big my stomach is. I'm just around the house. That's why my pants sagging, y'all. I'm just around the house sitting here by myself. Stomach starting to overlap. I got titties. See, you got titties. This stomach is the, this is the, 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 the biggest carpet right here. Like, this is the biggest problem. This, this is the biggest enemy right here. Based on my weird shirt, my stomach's sticking out. This big ass pot belly. And it just makes me look so fucking old, man. Um, that's not even talking about my thighs. My thighs are just like... Y'all seen in previous videos how thick my thighs is. Like, I, I gotta lose this weight, man. <laughs> like, and then just, um... You know, like around my neck. I hate that, too. Like, when I be taking pictures, I gotta, like, hold my head down like this. Because these fucking rolls all around my fucking neck. And I just think, you know, just... You know, not just with the clothes and how bad the weight makes me feel and how tired and drained I be and how sluggish I am and how lazy I become. You know what I mean? It affects all that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't even walk up the stairs without having to stop and, you know, catch my breath. Like, it's just crazy. I want more energy. I'm, I'm 35 years old. Like, I'm too young. To, to be like this, you know what I'm saying, and I want better for myself, so I have to do better, and so I'm gonna try. Uh, I mean, I'm going to do. I'm not gonna try. I'm going to do. So, yeah, my weight loss journey started today. I'm gonna get a treadmill, like 30 minutes a day, 15 minutes in the morning, 15 minutes in the evening, and then I'll, you know, I'll see extend the time, and I'll be on the treadmill longer once you know my body. Gets used to being on the treadmill. I don't want to put too much of myself um, too early on. 
But you like I said, seventy five percent of weight loss is really what you eat. So if I just change what I eat, I'm gonna lose a lot of weight just off of that alone. You know. Um, so that's the that's the plan, y'all. Um, that's the plan. Well, let me show you my treadmill. Treadmill's right here. Treadmill's right here. Big ass shred, man. I purchased this uh, before I went to London. So, yeah. Trailer 47.